Hello guys and welcome back to my channel. And I think to myself, what a wonderful So today's video is going to be an update on my project wax. So this is a candle project pan in which I have 10 candles in at a time. And the goal is really to just decrease my candle collection because I went a little crazy at candle day. So <laughs> um, let's go ahead and get started with everything that I finished up in the last month because I know that's what you guys want to see the most. That's what I would like to see the most as well. So we're just going to go ahead and get into it. So first I'm going to start off with single wicks. The first one that I finished up is pumpkin spice latte. This took me one, two, three, four, five months to finish up. Yeah, it took me a while. I think it has been in since the start of the winter project. Um, the scent notes are fresh espresso pumpkin pie spice whipped cream and a sprinkling of cinnamon sugar It really to me smelled like cafe au lait just like milk and coffee Really really good. I didn't get much pumpkin spice There's a little bit of like cinnamon sugar or something in there, but yeah, it was a good it was a good candle I probably won't um I have a new theory on single wicks. I think I'm only going to buy them if either I'm going to use them in the bathroom exclusively only in the bathroom or if they only come in that scent in a single wick. Like if this, that scent's not available in a three wick. For example, peppermint marshmallow, which I also finished last month. So um, this one is from this past winter. It took me one, two, three, four, five months to use it up. And this scent was the bomb. It was so good. Mm, it smells burnt now. <laughs> Basically, it smelled like a combination between vanilla bean marshmallow and like a peppermint. Um, I guess kind of like twisted peppermint. So yeah, it was a really, really good scent. I think it was so subtle with the peppermint that I literally, I enjoyed it so much. Um, this one only came out last year in a single wick. And I think it was maybe online exclusive. I don't remember. Um, but yeah, so things like this where it only came out in this single wick packaging, um, like now they have a pistachio ice cream candle online that I'm thinking of getting because it only comes in that one single form. Um, that's my new theory on single wicks. So, but yeah, anyways, I finished up those two single wicks. The next candle that I finished up is a three wick in Mary Cookie. This is from this past winter time. And the scent notes are fresh baked cookies, sparkling sugar crystals, and rich vanilla. It just smelled like cookies. It only took me one month to finish this up. It was about halfway used, and then I just finished it this past month. Um, I really focused on it to try and use it up. It just smelled like cookies with a little bit of spice. Um, nothing major. It didn't really burn too well, and I don't know, maybe it was my fault. Maybe I let it burn for too long, and then like the rest of the way, it smelled like soot, kind of. So I think that might have been my fault. But yeah, it was okay. Uh, I don't know if I would get it again next year. It's like nothing special. Um, the next one that I have that I finished is Hot Cocoa and Scream. Now, y'all, this was a good one. It took me um, one, two, three months to finish. This is a powerhouse thrower. It's it's so strong. And it literally smells like the powdered hot cocoa. And so I'm definitely going to get this again next year. It smelled amazing. It just made my whole room smell like cocoa smell like chocolate it smelled so good and the packaging was really really pretty so i loved that i'm kind of sad to see it go but also i feel like this is very seasonal really like fall and winter exclusively so those are the only candles that i finished off let's go ahead and get into the ones that i have some progress on the first one is goose creek's white icing cinnamon roll um i actually don't have any progress on this one i didn't burn it a single time in the last month here is the progress lines from the past four months uh where are we we started here and then went to here 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 maybe i burned it once because it's like a little bit below the line i'll mark it but i really didn't i maybe i burned it once i'm kind of sick of this candle it kind of smells like soot which again could be my user error but it's like so i don't even know like sticky buns kind of not like cinnamon rolls so i don't know it's just not my favorite i haven't been burning it lately we'll try again next month <laughs> i'll just say that the next one that i have a lot of progress on actually is goose creek's let's stay home this one i've been burning exclusively in the bathroom and i'm gonna go ahead and mark where the progress is at i kind of just like i come home from work i put this I turn this candle on i mean i light this candle up and i leave it there for like three or four hours in the bathroom and it's so good so 
this is the progress in the last month pretty good it's probably going to be finished up by the next update they don't put their scent notes down here but i'll try to get it from the website if it's still up there and um get you guys the notes but it i don't know how to describe it it's kind of like cashmere but kind of clean and i just knew i wouldn't want to burn it in my bedroom but it actually is a really good scent for the bathroom and it gets rid of odor really well so i've actually really been enjoying this i don't think i'll buy it again just because those scents are not my favorite um but you know i got use out of it i'm sorry if y'all can hear the yard men they're across the street but i'm not gonna stop filming i'm sorry <laughs> The next one that I have some progress on is Vanilla Bean Marshmallow. This was an online exclusive last uh, Christmas time. I think this packaging is beautiful for any time of year. It's just like stars and a moon. Um, the scent notes are accompanying a comforting vanilla fragrance that evokes the sweetness of a homemade marshmallow with, with essential oils. I agree. It smells like literally just like marshmallows. And this and peppermint marshmallow smell super simil similar, just the without the peppermint um here's the progress in the last month not bad uh this one also has started to smell like so so i don't know if that's my fault um we used a lot of my candle collection during like the whole winter storm that happened with texas where we were out of power for like two days so i mean we might have had this candle going for like six hours and we just like didn't care um so that might have been the problem and that's why like you can see there's some discoloration with this part of the wax so i don't know i'm just gonna finish it it doesn't smell too bad like it's not like too much soot scent to it so i'm just gonna finish it off and be done with it but it was really really good um if it comes out again i would definitely consider getting it again the next one that i have is strawberry pound cake this one i've actually really been loving strawberry pound cake recently um it is fresh strawberries golden shortcake whipped cream with essential oils let me go ahead and mark um on the packaging where i'm at i haven't burned it that much but i have burned it a few times so here's the progress lines one month and then in the last month i really probably only burned it once then but it smells really good i definitely see where people can get like a yogurty smell and i kind of like the yogurty smell to be honest with you i kind of like it so yeah this is a really good one i'm probably going to pick up another one of these at sas again um in the summer because i i really like it and strawberry scents strawberry scents are really some of my favorite scents the next one i have is white chroma cold brew one of my all-time favorite candles literally all-time favorites um this is from last february and i want to say i got it yeah i got it in summer sas summer 2020 the scent notes are cold brew coffee vanilla sweet cream warm caramel drizzle literally smells like straight caramel with a dash of coffee it's like not coffee that much which is why some people don't like it. I think it's kind of misleading because it's literally just like caramel with a dash of coffee. Definitely not cold brew, but it smells so good. I really, really love it. Um, here's the progress that I've gotten. So this was one month and then in the last month I got this much. So definitely been burning it a lot and it's probably gonna be gone really soon since it's so close to the bottom, but I've been really enjoying that one. And then some progress I also have on Eucalyptus Mint, the single wick. I'm gonna go ahead and mark where it's at. This one I also use in the bathroom. Um, I haven't been using it as much as the Goose, Goose Creek Let's Stay Home, so it doesn't have a lot of progress, but here is that. Um, made with Eucalyptus, Peppermint, and Clary Sage essential oils. So not a lot into this scent but it is a very good winter not winter <laughs> a very good bathroom scent and a very good de-stressing scent so super good for like spa days or something i love this and that's everything for all the updated ones now i have some new ones to introduce so the first thing i'm going to do is the single wicks so i did finish up two single wicks in the last month but unfortunately i only have one more single wick left in my collection to add to this um, besides ones that I'm saving for Christmas. So the only one that I have left that I can add in here is champagne toast. So I'm going to add in champagne toast and I actually already burned it once. So I marked it at the top. Uh, it was all the way unused and now we're down to here. So I'm gonna just go ahead and mark it anyways. This one is bubbly champagne, sparkling berries, juicy tangerine. It's a powerhouse for a single wick. I burned it in my bedroom and it, you could definitely smell it like even almost across the hall. It smells so good. It really just kind of smells like that juicy, um, juicy tangerine. That's what I get the most from this candle. It smells really, really good. I'm very excited to be using it in the spring and summer because I feel like it's like a perfect spring and summer like bubbly scent. 
And then I have a few three wicks that I'm going to add in. So the first one is gonna replace Hot Cocoa and Scream, and that is, drum roll please, Vanilla Me Noel, my favorite. This is definitely my favorite winter scent, maybe my favorite scent of all time. Um, vanilla bean, marshmallow fluff, vanilla cake, so good. And a lot of people said this wasn't strong, but it's kind of not, it's not strong. Um, but in my bathroom, it's like a powerhouse. So I used this, I think once in my bathroom already. So I have, I marked it before I put it in and now we're down to here. I've only used it once, but yeah, it's uh, it's definitely a good scent. This is one of my favorites and I'll definitely enjoy using it. The next one that I'm gonna introduce is going to replace Mary Cookie and I'm just gonna replace it with another cookie scent. And that is Sugared Snickerdoodle, also from last winter. And I went ahead and marked it for you guys. So we're right about here. It kind of um, didn't pull out fully the last time I used it. So that's why it looks like that. But this is Warm Spices, Creamy Vanilla and Sugared Musk. Basically, I feel like this has a lot of caramel in it to me. It has a lot of, lot of caramel and a little bit of spice, but not much cookie. So that's kind of odd, but yeah. I am never one to stray away from caramel scents, even though some people think they're like a little too cloying, which sometimes they are. I have to be in the mood for them, but I do enjoy a good caramel scent, and I think this one is like mainly caramel to me. Um, so yeah, I'll enjoy using this one, but definitely want to get it used up because I'm trying to get through all of like my wintry candles so that way I can buy some when SAS comes around or possibly not buy some and then go crazy in the fall because I love me some fall candles. So yeah, so that is actually everything for this project. I'm only gonna have nine candles in this project now because I don't have any more single wicks that I can even add in. Um, and I wanted to keep it at three single wicks per time, but I only have two single wicks in the project right now and then seven full-size candles. So we're just at nine right now, but like that's totally fine with me. I don't want to kind of overwhelm myself with different scents. Um, and some of the ones that I have left to put in this project are either like spring slash summer or kind of very similar to the ones that are already in. So we're just going to wait and I'll add some more stuff in next update but that's everything that i have for now let me know down below some candles that you are really loving burning lately i am burning a love every bunny sweet carrot cake right now it is so good it really makes me crave fall scents um but i feel like it's very seasonally inappropriate and i kind of don't want to burn them um but this one's like an excuse to kind of burn the fall scent but it's not fall get my drift anyways yeah, let me know your favorite candles that you're burning right now. And thank you guys so, so much for watching. If you enjoyed, like, comment, and subscribe down below. And I will see you guys in my next video. Bye.